Summer is alive with activities to do and see. Seasonal events abound throughout Clark County, including farmers markets, festivals, and the biggest draw of the year, the Clark County Fair. Great food is often a significant part of these events. To ensure that the food people are consuming is prepared in a safe manner, Clark County Public Health staff work to educate and guide food vendors for a successful summer season. No ready to eat food would be touched by bare hands. Our food inspectors, they not only inspect unincorporated Clark County, but also within all the cities, all the events that might be happening within the cities and throughout the entire county. Those of food establishments can be large chains, they can be private restaurants, espresso stands, a lot of events that um, are nonprofits. So wh wherever it's happening in Clark County, we're out there doing inspections. And do you have a separate cooler for your raw meats? People expect food to be prepared safely. Foodborne illness is not only a health hazard, but bad for business. Public Health creates a partnership with all the various food operators, from fine dining to the snow cone vendor, to help protect the public from foodborne illness. Our inspectors are looking for temperature of the food being served. Cold food should be held at a cold temperature below 41 degrees to prevent any bacteria growth. And then hot food needs to be held hot enough. If it drops too far below 135, then bacteria can start to grow in that food as well. So you need to keep cold food cold, okay. hot food hot to prevent that bacteria growth. Okay, we're good, we're at 184. Besides wearing gloves when handling food, inspectors are also looking for an on-site washing station and making sure food handlers are washing their hands often. An important tool for food safety inspectors, as well as food vendors, is a thermometer to confirm the hottest staying hot and the coldest staying cold. As you're serving food and you're operating, it gets really busy. That's one concern that we have is you, things get really busy. You've got a lot of people waiting for food and it gets pretty intense. It's really easy to start missing some of those basic sanitary practices of preparing food. So our inspectors are out there making sure that people are sticking with those safe food handling principles. After we open it, so I've got the ice. Okay. Public health staff attend pre-event meetings to provide information to vendors and make sure they are permitted. Public health also reviews a vendor's operation plan and gives advice on any potential risks. Then once set up, an inspection is done of the operation to make certain safe food handling practices are being followed. Temporary food events, it's an opportunity for people that want to get involved in the restaurant business. It's an entry point for that industry. We definitely do take a partnership approach to educate operators and owners. A lot of people with temporary food events, they're new to the industry, and so helping them evaluate their operation, evaluating how it's gonna actually run in the field when they're setting up their booth, making sure that the food's being prepared safe is important. For more information on the Public Health Food Safety Program, or to see online restaurant inspection results, visit Clark County's website at clark.wa.gov slash public dash health.